Howdy, howdy, howdy. Come on in. Hey, I'm Morgan from Seven Dust. Hey, I'm LJ, and uh, welcome to our home. This is, uh, this is the front lounge. It's popped out. Normally, when you ride, you come this way and see if it would pop into about right here. You don't even have that much room, so it's good to have an extended thing, would you say? Yes. Some fish oil, a little magnesium. This is uh, good for the, uh, for the soreness without the chemicals and all that stuff. Some ball spray right here. Who uses that? I think that this is Bobo's. This is insane. Why do you even need that? It's the shower should be plenty. I would think <laughs> just that's that nasty, right? <laughs> to me, that is. A few of the guys love the Diet Coke. Um, go through a lot of that. We got uh, some craft, micro brews. Yeah, we like craft brews a lot. Just being this guy, we get into the craft brews. Actually, when I get home on this break, I'll be brewing my own beer. And I think I'm going to call it Broken Welcome. Or Diet Coke. <laughs> or it's not the other discussion. <laughs> Gatorade is always good for you know, with the vodka <laughs> drink, you know. Hydrate yourself a little bit while you're getting all bent. Now, we just left uh, a town boss, uh, in Massachusetts, uh, Northampton. Uh, Hampton Beach. Hampton Beach. And uh, they brought us out uh, spaghetti, meatballs, and we had a big feast. We had lobsters. So there's some leftover stuff in there, nothing too exciting. It's awesome to have a shower on the tour bus, especially when you're on a tour where there's no showers to be taken and to be had. And you get off a road, and you know you might play outside a lot of these tours, and you're sweaty. It's cool to be able to come to the bus and take a shower and relax, you know. So, uh, you got some dudes in the in the band that like to tear up on the protein there. And look, I was so excited because no one else has tried the new McDonald's wings for a limited time only. These things are great, like the McRib. So I guess it says something in it that's like the McRib. I don't know if it's like some type of crack or something, but I've only had them several times, but they are good. I just uh, shout out to McDonald's. Cereal, uh, cereal area. Coffee. Oh, wait a minute now. We got a little bit more of this stuff. Cups and, you know, it's kind of boring around here. Yeah, coffee, yeah, coffee cups. Well. Uh, this, this stuff here is nothing major. I think there's probably you know, chips and, you know, a bunch of yeah, this is usually where it is, and all Look, of this that's you. stuff. All this Three stuff. Look, that's you. That's, that's yeah. right now, Bus Invaders. My girlfriend was here last night, and she thought it'd be real cute to put a little line on the threes, you know, and make it boob, LJ Morgan, you know. Adolescent behavior. So, so does that mean boob? Like boob. Boob. Wow. Yeah, this one's here. That's weird. Yeah, it's just, you know, just absolutely unacceptable behavior. <laughs> <laughs> this is where we sleep, or what you call try to sleep, in the bunk. This is, this is my area. It just so happens that it's not the absolute worst today. Got my pajamas ready to go. Got a little mini iPad. You got TVs with DVD players. I broke that the other night because I got pissed. You got pictures of your loved ones in here. Got ah. my girlfriend here. I got my kids here. Keep a little folder with my kids and everything in there. You can knock on a curtain. You knock on a curtain like this. And you open it up, and you go like, oh, it's so loud right now. <laughs> see, that's what, that's what I talked about earlier, being considerate. You see, there's Vinny, y'all. Say hello, that's the boss man. Clint Lowry down there, the famous this, legend. This is nap time. I'll show you my bunk. I just have something special before we go to this. And this is a new term that I've heard only one time, and it was screamed very loud by a, a gentleman. And he said, open the back galley. We gotta put on my new birthday present. This is, uh, since I turned 41, I feel uh, a little older, and this hat makes me feel all grown up. Is it cool? After you. <laughs> tons and tons of cases. <laughs> it's not that bad. Is, actually, it's not too bad. I had somebody deliver some of this to me uh, the other day. Oh, she said I was supposed to have some of that. I said I hadn't seen it. Now, of course, I won't get any of it. A little peach sea hag rum. A little blueberry sea hag rum, a little uh, strawberry sea hag rum, and somehow or another I, I did confiscate the peanut butter cookies that everybody's looking for. Oh, yeah. You know what? But this this area back here, a lot of times I'll have a lava lamp out, the incense will be burning, some music will be playing, and it's really cool. We call him the Heat. The Heat's been out on tour with us since the beginning of this year. And this is all road worthy. This has never been used before, but look how beat up it is just from sitting in the back. <laughs> yes, this is it, man. You know, and sometimes if you get back here, you're able to, you know, you can pop the couch out a little bit if you want to relax a little more. Put it back in. I've never used that. That was given to me from a lady in uh, New Orleans, though. So. Uh oh, what's and it, this? That's what's Gan that? Gandalf. <laughs> Cigarette use only. That's not the <laughs> that was a gift to me, like, too, and they called him Gandalf. It's awesome. This, yeah, this is so back up here, you know. I mean, towels for the shower. 
That's uh, maybe Gandalf. Uh, <laughs> what are these things? <laughs> I didn't think you were gonna find that. <laughs> uh, TV gets watched back here. A lot of ridiculous. Uh, we love Rob and uh, his show. And we just try to, you know, pass the time. Uh, people bring out their laptops, hang out, Tons of go to the gym, you know, and we just try to keep sane out here on the road because you are in a small space. But we try to keep it clean and and smelling good and it's, and then as much as you know, bringing things like from home as much as we can and. Having our families out here every now and then makes it a lot easier too. All right. Thanks a lot for coming in and checking I'll out. I'll say your name again. I'm Morgan. Hey, I'm Meryl J. From Seven Dust. Thank you for coming and in, uh, invading our bus and our home territory, and we enjoyed having you. Bus Invaders, it's been a pleasure for you guys being here, and uh, we hope to see you guys again. And we hope that uh, we gave you guys a little bit of how we live out here on the road and what we do and how we like to be. So next time, we'll see you guys. Peace. Bye. <laughs>